I don't know how to start a video, but I'm Hootless, and this is RimWorld Isis Episode 1. So, we're, we're actually going to get into the meat of things now, if you will. Uh, our animals are all mating, apparently. Let's unforbid everything real quick. In fact, I'll just uh, zoom way out and use the unforbid tool that we've got. I don't want to unforbid everything on the map. Just, just like all the stuff in this area. So we'll do that. And, yep, that worked. So, what we need to do is start putting together some kind of fortress. We'll uh, designate some stuff to be deconstructed and definitely assign everybody the proper work priorities here. Mostly this first episode is just going to be trying to get things set up and, you know, get into a place where we can actually survive for a long period of time, ideally. Let's, uh, put everything up to where we need it to be. Everyone can have four mining. Uh, three cleaning, three research, except on him. On her, I guess, Lana. Uh, hunting, you can be priority two. I don't know why I have three people that are good at crafting, but I do. So we will set it up like this, and like this. Actually, let's just have Krieger craft. Other people can craft, but I want them crafting less. Ideally. But Krieger can be our main crafter. Uh, he's not particularly better at it. He's just the same, really. But uh, that'll give him something to do. We'll also have Archer Hunt and not research. In fact, I don't want anybody researching unless, like, they have to. And then we'll have Archer equip one of the bows and Lana equip the other bow. Everybody gets construction at a four, repair at a one. And that will do for now. There'll definitely be a better solution for it relatively quickly here. But for now, that'll do. Also, these uh, concrete slab walls are so sturdy. It's kind of ridiculous, actually. Uh, everybody gets plant cutting as well, just in case I ever need plants to be cut. I want them cut. In fact, I will... Uh, I'll set that to priority one, because they'll only ever have to plant cut if I tell them to. And typically, if I'm telling them to plant cut, I want it done, like, immediately. So we'll set that up, chop away some of the, we'll just say like two tiles out around the entire area here. And we're definitely claiming this as our own. Uh, let's just go ahead and chop it open like that. Yeah, that'll do. Where is everybody? Alright, they're, they're getting to it. There's also a garbage truck outside at the most inconvenient time. Alright, there's like some birch trees in here. Oh my god, there's a cobra. Stay away, cobra. Don't be rude. Alright, so they've chopped away like two tiles out like I wanted them to. And it looks like we are actually getting the concrete slabs back so we can fill in the holes here. Yeah. So definitely want one there, one there, one there, across like that. Actually, no, not, not right there. Because we're going to bring it up and around anyways, so might as well if we get enough. Area revealed, and I'm just going to plant cut everything that's in there and deconstruct all the old shelves. I don't actually know what I get from the old shelves when they're deconstructed. Hopefully it's useful. I don't know if we've deconstructed any yet. It's possible. So in here will probably be our cooler area. I'll uh, push these walls up a tiny bit. It's kind of annoying that it's disjointed like this. But overall, it's fine. Also, we only need to really construct two walls there anyways. 
So we'll do that, and let's construct a door out of concrete slabs. Right there, right there. That does take 50. That's not great. Let's uh, very, very quickly put together five beds. Oh, that's actually like perfect. Nope. Just, uh, just gonna fix the work priorities real quick. Do that. So fortunately, the benefit of having a place like this is that it's actually very secure. Each of these concrete slab walls has like three times the health. Yeah, about three times the health of like a rock wall. So we will definitely be safer in here, unless they drop in through the ceiling, of course, which is an ever-present problem. But uh, beyond that, like we can just dig into this mountain and be relatively safe, hopefully. That, that's sort of the plan, at any rate, for right now, is uh, we're going to set up base here, and once we start getting more and more raids, we will dig into the mountain and basically seal it off. We will have an opening so we can get to the outside, but for the most part we're going to be staying inside, where it's nice and secure. They're taking a long time to put up the roofs. I'm not sure why. Interesting. Um, I guess we can leave that. Let's just order them to like chop down the trees in here. Oops, chop down the trees. And also I'll cut down this plant. Like we don't want any trees inside of this area. In fact, we don't really want any of anything in this area other than beds and stuff. We don't want any plants is the point. But let's also deconstruct all of these walls, and these walls, and just try to collect up a few uh, concrete slabs, you know. Since it is very useful, uh, what's this? It's old shelves going into the mountain. Like, it's very useful to have the uh, concrete slabs, and plus, actually constructing walls like this will allow us to uh, be more secure. So, let's put down some torches, sort of, along the hallway here. This will probably be its own room, and so will this. I don't know what's going to go in either of those rooms, but something. Something will go in there. What is that? Concrete? Just on the floor, I think. So let's put down a concrete slab wall. Concrete slab wall. There's a major break risk. Let's also very, very quickly... Uh, what's the trainable intelligence of alpacas? Intermediate. Not really good enough. So every alpaca gets hunted. In addition, every megatherium gets... Uh, not, not tamed yet. We will tame them eventually, but for now, like, I just want to leave them be... We'll attack the turkeys, though. And I guess we'll also hunt down... Oh, wait, no, yeah, okay. That'll be a problem for a short period of time. We don't really have access to a cooler. We can't, uh... You know, we can't do the electricity thing at all yet. So we will have to fix that relatively quickly. Uh, furniture... No, production. Yes. Simple research bench does require some steel. But hopefully, that can be fixed. What do you mean space already occupied? Oh right, the torch. Okay. I was gonna say. Don't you lie to me. There we go. We'll put that there. We'll deconstruct the wall here. Uh, I don't know where everybody went. Okay, they got this though. Area revealed. Area revealed. All the time. Alright, so let's set up a stockpile zone in here. Steel here. I guess we deconstructed some steel walls, maybe. This can be food and corpses. Animal corpses. 
Next up, we need a general stockpile. Maybe refurbish this area up here into a complete thing. Possibly. Let's uh, speed it up a little bit and see if we can get slightly more done here. No, don't eat the corpse. Uh, what are you doing? Alright, we need a butcher's table so that at least they aren't eating corpses. Oh, it was a dog at least. Okay. That's slightly better. Oh, God. Oh, no. Why is this timber wolf attacking? Lana, get down here. I'm starting to, like, actually dislike this, uh... This hostile forest mod. Because it just makes it so that these animals attack us without any provocation. So we just lost an entire colonist, a quarter of our colonists. Because this wolf decided that, that he was going to attack us. Ugh. So this, this colony might end r relatively quickly. Just due to the fact that uh, this wolf decided to be a dick. But when this colony ends, I will remove the Hostile Forest mod. Even though it does make it denser, I'll just replace it with, like, uh, a less intense version. That's... Oh, Pam, you rescue Lana. Oh, no. What are you, what are you doing? Also, this wolf is attacking everybody. The rhinos aren't even helping. Archer, don't don't rescue Lana. Just like kill that melee wolf, that kill that melee wolf, kill that timber wolf. That timber wolf isn't being a dick, but you know melee attack that wolf to death. They can pay. And Krieger, I know you want to feed the corpse to Lana, but like rescue Lana though. Who is our constructor? That would be Krieger. Work on the butcher table. Please. Stop hauling wood to torches. I just want you to build the table. Put your creature on repeat. So at least they can eat meat instead of corpses, which gives less of a negative. Damn it. Pam is in a mental break now. Yeah, this, this colony is going to go downhill pretty quickly, unfortunately. The uh, dense forest thing just makes it too difficult at least uh, in the areas that it affects because it doesn't affect every biome it just affects like the temperate rainforest the forest and the jungle I think so uh, you know like if I wasn't in one of those areas it wouldn't be as bad but the fact that I am makes it really difficult to do anything plus there's all these animals which isn't bad I can hunt them if, you know, the, uh, hostile ones don't kill all of my people. Yeah, Krieger, could you, uh, treat Lana? I need her healed. She's no longer incapable of walking, at least, so that's something. Let's, uh, go to production... And we'll make a fueled stove, even though I really don't want to. Krieger, prioritize that. What did Brett even do? It doesn't say. Can I look at his character stats here? I can. Okay, he was he was our constructor. Okay, that's not great. That's actually pretty bad. But, uh, you know, I guess might as well get rid of the extra negative debuff by burying him. Cancel that. There we go. Let's just make four. Four graves real quick. And set this up to make simple meals. There we go. Uh, do until you have like five. Pause on completion. Resume on will stock. Only resume when you've got like one left. Otherwise, you'll just be cooking all the time. 
But now we have actual simple meals, and that should hold us off until we can, uh, you know, get into like a slightly better place. So we'll put that there. Uh, this one never got completed for some reason. I know we have concrete slabs. We've got a lot of concrete slabs. So, Krieger, no, work on this. Work on the door. So that that can at least be an enclosed area, even if it, you know, can't be totally finished yet. What is everybody doing? Pam's in a mental break. Archer is hunting in alpaca. I guess not terrible. I'm gonna have him stop hunting, though. He can kill those two, but I don't want him hunting also the turkeys. Just because if we hunt too much, then the food will go bad before we can eat it. So you have to eat, like, a small amount. You have to eat some, but not too much. And you gotta make sure you keep that equilibrium up until, uh... Where, where's Krieger? I have no idea where he is. Krieger, where are you? Oh, he was like way over there grabbing a corpse or something. So, uh... Uh, Lana got the plague? Wow. Alright, Krieger, butcher? No, no, no. Prioritize treating. We only have herbal medicine, but you need to get this done. Please, there's so many trees out there blocking the movement. Alright, so that should hold her off for a little bit. Ideally, she won't die of the plague. We don't have a lot of herbal medicine left. We've only got like six, I think, in total. And that's not ideal. Not in the slightest. Uh, manufactured, let's store medicine and drugs in there as well, even though it's just a tiny little area. We'll probably expand it outwards to here or so. Let's cancel that. Uh, structure... Slab, slab. Uh, this place is gonna be called Isis. Cancel that wall. Okay, so... Despite the fact that we lost Brett, uh, we're, you know, not in a horrible place, I guess. We could be in a worse place, that's for sure. Let's clear out some more of the trees in front of our home. Nobody has construction at one, that's why nothing's getting done. Alright, oh god. Lana's being attacked by a lynx. Why? This lynx just decided to be so rude. Right after Lana got healed. Oh great. The lynx is uh, gonna kill her. Yep. Uh, Bullface has become a manhunter. That's not ideal. We're down to uh, three colonists now, which isn't, uh, that's, not what we, that's not what you want when you start with five colonists. Also, because uh, all these people are blocking up the door, Pam can't get out. So Pam's just going to sort of sit there and uh, die. I I'm trying to tell Pam to move. Go. Run into the cooler. Well, also Bullface was somehow able to open up that door. Archer, buddy, I need you to bite the bullet and kill this dog. Okay. Ah, oh, man, the dog can open up doors. Okay, so basically, I can't really do anything here. So we're going to uh, pretend this episode didn't happen. And next episode, I'm going to come back. 
And we're going to have started over. I'm going to, in between this episode and next episode, uh, delete this save forever, remove the mod that made this basically impossible, and then I'm going to recreate the world with basically everything the same. Like, the world itself will be different, but, uh, you know, all the same people, the same abilities, and all that stuff. And I'll just get that out of the way, and then we'll come back and not die two random animals attacking us but thank you guys so much for watching sorry that this one didn't go as planned and uh hope you guys are still looking forward to the rest of the series but other than that i'll see you guys all next time leave a like and a sub and a comment would be cool and maybe you could check out more of my channel bye